In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to speed run the Union Depository contract, which at the time of making this video is double money, paying out well over half a million dollars and is the highest paying mission from the auto shop. With the help of fellow speedrunner Kenny, who are now both the fastest so far on console, we've tested the best ways to complete this heist solo in the fastest possible way. Unlike many other YouTubers who just bang out an alleged guide while being absolutely clueless in this mission and just wanting to be first for views. Toss a sticky bomb or grenade at the other cars in the same role. Welcome to my guys for the Union Depository contract. This will be a solo guide as some strats for this will change if you're doing it as a co-op, particularly the finale. So the first thing you want to do is the setup. That means stocking up on snacks and buying full body armor. I'll bet you'll be ready to use that the second you get out the door. You then want to head to this location Face up the road and call in your terabyte so it spawns just behind you. Get in and park it just here in the parking lot. When you steal the baller later, the drop off will be right here. You then want to head over to LSIA and call in your sparrow. And park it on the helipad right here. The reason being is that the police chopper spawn location is connected to the location the bank manager ends up at. This is manipulating where he'll go. Then depending on your auto shop location, you may want to get a hydra ready and park it right outside. If your auto shop is close to LSIA, then you can skip this step. Now on to the robbery. You first want to select the vault code mission. Jump in your hydra and fly over. For how to do the Hydra speed boost, check out the guide in the pop-out banner in the top right. Pop out and kill the two coppers. Then fly this way to the parking lot. When you approach, press the L3 button on PlayStation to stop the chopper floating away. Scan the blue fister. And now wait for the bank manager to arrive at the hotel. You're now looking for a woman who can spawn at three locations up here. When you found her with the bank manager, wait for him to put his arm around her, then take the photo. If you get this message at the bottom of the screen, you can head back to your auto shop. Mission complete. Here. We got him good. For the second prep, it will be either at Long Bank or Del Perro apartment. And he just gonna hand it over. You feel me? Get inside and pop everyone in your way with the assault shotgun. Select the elevator key from this guy in the bedroom v. and then run back out. We better finesse this bank robbery shit. Blast everyone in the garage with the shotgun. And escape in the baller. Make sure to put your oppressor back into storage here as you'll need it again shortly. Now take this route to the parking lot. As soon as you arrive, run inside your terabyte, which will complete the mission. Hop on your oppressor and head back to the auto shop to start the finale. The best car to use for this one is the Coleco. When you exit your car, jump to go faster and get it. The front door, walk right out with the goal. Mm. That's right. Let's do this. As soon as you arrive, pull out your gun. For security. Gotta play the part. This will alert the guards, but also allow you to run at full speed. Kill anyone you need to and head to the elevator. Now try to look like you got a head injury and you failed the LSPD psych test. You know, you're a little slow. We 
got no time to enjoy this. Get the gold, get moving. Shit, I was just starting to have a little fun. Once you've grabbed the gold, you have a few enemies to take care of. Don't worry too much if they're not dead, you just need enough time to escape. No fucking way! Two more noose just here. Oh, shit. And one at the exit. Keep your head down, just get to the parking lot. Be sure to keep an eye on your health and kill noose and the police to give you a path to the left. These fools ain't never gonna stop, y'all. Get to the damn car. Take out the coppers here and you'll be able to steal their cruiser. This car you can access will only spawn when doing it solo, so bear that in mind. Be sure to stock up on snacks and armor here and then drive to your getaway vehicle. There will be two drop off locations, either the lighthouse at El Gordo or the diner at North Chumash. Do not get the chopper by the Diamond Casino, as we've tested it and it's either slower or about the same time as the car, and also less consistent. When you're en route, you can call in Diversion, which will help you lose the cops on the way. Keep your inventory open just in case you need to refresh your health bar. She cool, she cool. Yo, she's saying you made it. Deliver the goods and mission complete in 17 minutes, 21 seconds. Timely as shit. If you have found any faster strats, please let us know in the comments. So if you found this video useful, please drop it a like and maybe consider subscribing for more. I'm Beats Down and I'll see you in the next one. Let the church say amen, baby.